Okay, so English or Pikachu? Pikachu, Pikachu, right? I don't speak. What language is this? I'm gonna assume it's a Russian because the developer is called Nikita Krikov. Yeah, Nikita Krikov. This game is called. It's a Ren P game, visual novel. Means it's a visual novel called Milk Inside the Bag of Milk Inside the Bag of Milk. Uh, okay. So let's just go, shall we? English. Because I don't speak Pikachu. Nikita Cuff, yeah, you see that. Oh, the song. Okay, it's, it's a horror visual novel, I assume. The audio volume? No, no. I'm good, I'm good. Help me by. Whoa, okay, I must say it's. I'm impressed. This game. It doesn't feel like that it's made by Renpy at all. It looks really different from the usual visual novel made in Renpy that I play. Okay. I already press OK. Okay. Come on, I already press OK. You, you can hear my mouse clicking. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Ah, it... Mm. I have to use enter, okay, and arrow button. I think we have to use mouse. Write down your name. I'm gonna write a Russian name. Boris. Boris is cool. Oh, the sound. Oh my god, this is a psychological horror. It is. It's getting louder, right? It's uncomfortable. Uh, in a good way, though, because it's supposed to be like that in this kind of... You feel that in the, in the left ear and uh, the right ear? Oh my god. It's really uncomfortable. I like it. Okay, I'm on my way to the store, rehearsing the speech. I haven't been out for so long that I have forgotten what words they say when they enter the store. Is there any words you say when you enter a store? Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, my god. I love, I love the... What do you call it? The typing sound of the dialogue? Who are you talking to? Who? Myself? Darn it. I imagine being a game character, what if it helps to gather my thugs? What game? Aha, uh -huh, like this one. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. I'm deeply breathing in. Okay, forgot what. 19th attempt and I'm failing again. Bite my lips with annoyance. Once again. Can I get... Uh-huh. Whoa, a whole word more? This time, the I sound was longer than usual. Who knows, I don't... What is happening? Okay then. Loser. Don't worry, yeah. Don't worry. By the way, you have been walking with your left foot on asphalt and your right foot on grass for a whole minute. Well, what's wrong with that? That's how people walk when they're bored. I mean, I, I did that, like, walking on those stones and not touching the ground or what? Well, only walk on the black or white, or what do you call it? A specific color tile. Don't you all do it? My left, my red, right leg froze in the air. How much? 50 steps on asphalt and 51 on grass. You will have to cancel the previous step. <laughs> How do you imagine it? This is not the first time. You're, 
Uh, nope, that's evil. I don't remember. Oh no, what what is happening though? From the beginning. So, step one, take a step back to get your food exactly into your own trail. What then? I don't understand what is happening. Step 50, take a step back to get your food exactly in your trail. Step, <laughs> okay, from step 1 to step 50. Oh, okay then. Yep. You're <laughs> hopeless. Oh, okay, we have to buy milk now. You will be very guilty if you don't do not buy milk. Darn, really? Are you ready? Yes. I gently changed the position of the, of the leg, peering carefully into the thick grass. Okay, is this the store? Okay then. I asked the very first person I met, where's milk? Ah, that's definitely a person. I see a hair in here, a face, I think, here, a hair too, hair and face, and a body, or is it a tree, I don't know, oh, oh, okay then, excuse me, what, oh, am I super, oh, I press O, okay, that does, not do anything. Okay, keep on repeating then. You better not do it. Aha, uh -huh. risk of falling into an endless loop. Uh, then what am I supposed to do? Oh, okay. What is he trying to tell you? Letter O. I'm pressing O, you know. What's so terrible about letter O? What's wrong with O? Okay, that's O. That's not an O, that's... Yep, that suddenly appears out of nowhere. I should have guessed. Yep, that's a good imagination you have there. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> At this point, you're too lazy even to say, excuse me, you just say what? I got her all the wheel into a fit. Ooh. <laughs> okay. You just repeat it after him. And it worked. Do it more often. Okay then. But did he really crawl? Uh, he crawl? Okay, that's a little bad. When exactly did you say that? Uh, back then? Just now? Okay then. Oh, okay, so... It's kinda confusing to... Decipher, not decipher, how do you say it? Kinda confused to... Confusing to... Really see... Where it's going... Between the dialogue of or the protagonist mind and voice okay bags of milk but who who put milk on a bag the two of us or two of us i thought you were alone and milk lies or maybe to buy milk? Yep. Okay then. Right here. Op opinion. <laughs> opinion. Something like not here. Not here. Take the bag and go to the cash desk. You are getting on my... Why? Just relax. And you like for spite? Like for spite? That didn't make a pause before the second one. I want to take away all my sm small victories. Back of milk inside. 
or rather a bag of milk inside a bag or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk or rather a bag of milk the text starting to get strange inside a bag of milk inside the bag reception yep 15 minutes before store closing hurry up visual novels yeah it is And by the way, the numbers are written there in full in letters. Are visual novels worse than books? Not really. In fact, I found it that it is more entertaining than normal novel. Of course, they have different... They are different from... How do you say it? They have different kind of entertainment. But for me, I found it with the visual of the visual novel it makes thing much more interesting but authors are not lazy there and you don't be lazy too not anymore so watch your language hee <laughs> hee ahem ahem anyway you heard me hurry up or there'll be no good at home okay what's gonna happen in home already running why do we need a bag of milk? Ah, the storekeeper. This is definitely a head. And a neck. And an arm? Okay, it's between or storekeeper is an alien or some kind of living trumpet. You have it? Give. Money? Okay then. Of course, not just bag, but milk too, okay then. What? <laughs> Neil, I need the bag of milk. No. Oh, that's really bad, considering the genre of this visual novel. Your mom probably will really throw you out of the window. Money. Hey. No, no, come on, don't let your, don't let the, your soap defeat you, you are stronger than, the, than your soap, you know, pay for milk. Two days, two days, but the store closed in 15 minutes. Walking down a familiar street past a gas station. Bag of milk unpleasantly pulls away my hand, reminding me of the time I took physical therapy. You know, I just realized perhaps this visual novel is a. How do you say it? A, a depiction of a person who has an anxiety problem. Like, their thought keeps on blaming them and they see the world as something that they see the world full of wolf or dangerous things that will always targeting to consume them. Just my guess. So now I'm carrying a bag of milk and set in her bag. Oh. Pyramidals paramedical structure of verbal construction a gas station is getting closer not the gas station you how are you feeling mile of ice cream what is that supposed to mean as if i tell you what but i'm really interested the ratio of water to milk and the volume of air occupied by me is about 30 to 1 Oh, so we are making ice cream with the milk. Uh huh. Okay, I don't understand. Uh, is it related to the distance? So the distance to this and that, it becomes ice cream. I don't understand. Simple maths. Okay. I feel movement under my feet. Asphalt grains, petrol stains. 
trying to keep my balance, and how do people move on something as uneven as the urban plain? Need hill soft. I count every meter of the way I've gone, I even close my eyes for more concentration. Watch out for what? I unconsciously take a sharp step aside at the same moment a huge bear a huge bear pass sweep pass with pass me with a wild ripple. You're talking to a bear. I'm throwing a stumbling pick at the rapidly moving animal. Oh, okay, why uh, its red eyes in turn look at me with mockery. Obrazen. It was a truck. Really? Uh, yeah, you're, you're kinda right. You might all. Uh, no, someone will not want it to happen, but if you just walk into the middle of the street, that would happen. Although, most of the time, yeah, the world is kinda cruel and dangerous, kinda. Ah, yeah, so... Yep, indeed, this person has an anxiety problem and or some kind of problem like that and try to cope with the world by transforming it into something more acceptable to them. The most bizarre way it's adjust, it adjusts to me. When I hurry, all the traffic lights are surfacefully extinguished. When I want to cry, a cloud appears and pour rain flows that hide my tears. See, I told you. Right now, I feel how the cloud is slowly gathering over my top. I'm sad. Are you sure all this is really happening? Oh well. Have you? I, I kinda confused on what, what should I pick. Sometimes the truth is good, but sometimes being silent is good too. On this matter, I don't have enough how to say it? Uh, you know, evidence or something like that to decide. But I have to decide. <sighs> okay then. The instruction did not say that at all. Apparently, this pills. See? I told you. They are taking pills. You know, probably. Pills have nothing to do with it. Uh, okay, okay, I'll, I'll be silent. Okay. What? Uh huh. As you say. A great place for cliched visual novel monologues. You want to talk? Yeah, I'm listening. You're a little embarrassed. Yeah, I know how you feel. <laughs> Ultimately, things will happen pointlessly, I hope. Yes? Really? An exemplary, I don't... What's an exemplary? I don't speak English. Oh, I have... <laughs> well, it's okay. It's... There are... There are other things you have in this world, not just reading visual novels. Sometimes I regret it because now I need a lot of effort just to distinguish letter and words. Let me tell you something. Don't be... Don't... It, it's okay to have regrets like that, but... Don't be too... 
don't be feel too estranged from the world. I mean, everyone has their regrets. Even the most perfect person who reads visual novel all the time, probably, or something like that, has their own regrets. By the way, it's okay. Yep. Okay. Okay. I understand. Uh huh. I did. Crazy and weird. <laughs> no. Nah, no, you're. Yeah, by the word definition, you are crazy, but. No. You're not. <laughs> you. You and I. You and this world. This whole. Person. There's a lot of people like you. You are not crazy. I am not crazy. We are just left behind. What is it like to see the world with my eyes? Red everywhere, huh? Used to it for a long time. What other colors look like? Let it go. It's okay. Because you know they wouldn't hurt you. They're the one who are scared. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> yeah, sometimes I would ask what happened or how are you or something like that. But if you say don't, then I will listen to you. I will do that. I promise. I said I promise though. No, I don't. I said I promise. What do you see? What do I see? I see a lake. Ah, oh, that's your dad. His part. Difficult family. Ah. I'm sorry. Uh huh. Yes. Do not screw up in front. <laughs> nah, it's okay. I don't know why I did it. Why I decided to become a character in visual novel for the sake of going to the store today, but it has clearly borne fruit. You're welcome. You are sad lately? Ever since your dad. Uh, I understand. It's okay. But you know what? Yep. I will not click that. No, is there any other way to advance? Oh no, I just realized the screen is cut in here. Oh no, that's a problem. Uh, well, I think it's been recorded.
there any other way to do this? Oh, wait. We can go back. No, I don't want to. <sighs> Fine. Yep, it's time for you to go home. I stop on my floor and hang by the railing. I stop being afraid of hikes. A few minutes ago, the pill finally came, came to now. I'm just enjoying blissful silence. Mixing with the sound of the world around me, they create a terrible dissonance in my head. I turn around and go to my apartment. That's the door, I could see. I think. Oh, hello there. I bring milk. Is this you? Hi, mom. You look precious. You look gorgeous. Yes. How about stay silence on that? Yes, mom. Well, I don't expect it to be this sad. I'm, I'm kind of feeling sympathy here instead of, you know, I I'm not scared. I'm feeling sympathy because in this world indeed exist people like this who they're not crazy, okay. They are just, we, we are just left behind by the world. We are left to, we are left in the trash, in the prison, in the hospital room, left to die. But, you know what, that someday will change. Someday, the world will accept all of us. That's all for the video. Thank you for watching. It's, it's good. I love it. Nikita Kruikov, you have made a good visual novel. See you later in my next video then. Bye-bye.